good Saturday evening going into Sunday morning. I'm Lisa Moser. You're here at the Weather Channel about to see uh, the next seven days. And keep in mind, this is a very active weather pattern. And oftentimes what we find uh, when we have an active weather pattern that we have to amend the forecast. So we may amend in six hours. We may amend in 24 hours. We may not amend until 36 or 48. But you'll need to check in to see exactly what changes have taken place uh, to see if things in your area are going to be as we have said uh, for the past 12 hours or the day before, okay? Here we go with the long wave pattern. It's a very amplified long wave pattern. And what I mean by that is we're seeing troughs, ridge, trough, ridge. And of course, when we see this going on, uh, we see some mixing. The more amplified, the sharper the ridges, the sharper the troughs, uh, the more mixing and the more dramatic the organization of a sur surface uh, feature will become. Let's go down to the surface. Now that I've said that, Keep in mind, again, that we have a very active weather pattern and changes are very likely as we go through uh, the extended forecast, okay? Uh, no doubt about it, we are looking at a snow uh, maker, a low pressure area, now a coastal storm uh, right over the shoreline of the Jersey area. And we're seeing some heavy snow now just to the west of Philadelphia, Scranton, PA, now looking at thunder snow. Earlier we had some thunder snow across the panhandle of extreme eastern West Virginia. And occasionally some of the bursts are going to put out one to two inches of snow in an hour's time. That's a lot of snow. That means some of us may be looking at maybe a foot of snow, maybe eight inches of snow. And certainly that's going to be the case the closer you are to the low pressure area. So Philadelphia, uh, the southeast area of New York and the Catskills, uh, much of Massachusetts, Rhode Island, Connecticut, likely to see some of the heavier bouts of snow overnight tonight and through the day tomorrow. Much of the midsection of the country not really experiencing a problem. We do have a minor system that's pulling